Hi, I'm Emily Matkin. Uh, my daughter Evelyn Matkin was diagnosed with encephalitis four years ago and she spent three months in the children's hospital. Um, based on her diagnosis, she had some challenges recovering and regaining movement and uh, with speech and just kind of everything overall since it impacted her basal ganglia, which is the um, center of the brain that controls all the, uh, the motor function. Um, and we started seeing Dr. LeBeau a couple months ago and after the first visit, um, immediately started seeing improvements in her kind of ability to concentrate, focus on smaller tasks, um, participate in different activities and just her movement overall. And so have been very satisfied with the treatment that we've received. I've seen a lot of changes in what she was not able to do. And like, what are some of the things that you noticed early on and then uh, and over the time period. Yeah, so specifically, um, since we started coming, I would say with it, after that first treatment or second treatment, started seeing her able to sit down and like control a pen, start using a pen a little bit more, um, seeing more excitement and eagerness to read and just sit down and do tasks individually and independently on her own, uh, which was a big change uh, compared to what we'd, we'd seen previously from her. So I would say that was one of the biggest things that we started recognizing. Uh, she's a lot more calm, seems more confident, seems more um, just excited, enthusiastic about different things. And so um, that I would say just consistently since we've been coming here has been the biggest um, change that I've recognized. And one of the things that it seems that from what you were saying that she uh, wasn't engaged a whole lot in either activity or schoolwork. It seemed both physically as well as mentally, but it sounds like she's more doing more? It sounds like she's uh, getting better scores on Yeah, her. absolutely. So she um, is based on just her recovery. She is on an IEP program at school. So she has an individualized educational program. She's in fourth grade. Um, so it gives her a lot of special accommodations, uh, different goals academically. Um, and we actually are meeting with the school in a couple weeks to reassess that because she's actually now achieved all of her goals from an academic perspective, which is really exciting. And I would say um, the diagnosis that she had was three or four years ago now um, and we had kind of reached a stalled point in her recovery where we were starting to kind of think okay is this the end state and is this what long term looks like for her specifically um, and since we started coming here there's been like a, a second wave of like recovery and this accelerated kind of growth and development that we didn't see previously and there's nothing else that we've changed um, besides coming here and taking the supplements that uh, Dr. LeBeau has recommended. Oh, great. Yeah, really exciting. <laughs>